All right. Well, we're going to take a couple of minutes here, and if you haven't done this before, I'm going to walk you through the process of creating a Google website, also called Google Sites. So the first thing you'll have to do is go into your Google Drive. That's where you start. Once you're in uh, the folder where you want your website to be stored, uh, there's always going to be a back end that you can edit and a front end that people can view. So we have to go uh, to your Google Drive to start this process. Once you're there, uh, you go to New, click down to More, and choose Google Sites. Okay, so some just basic editing uh, functions here. Um, you can change the title of the site. If you want to change the image that's in the header, you can either upload your own or select an image from various images here. You can even do a search if you want. Okay kind of looks funky suggesting it <laughs> all right um, if you want to add content to the page you can either click over here and choose from these content um, options there's also some more options down here for formatting and whatnot or you can just double click for a real simple and you can add an image you can add text you can upload something so that's how you add content um, to each of the uh, to each of the pages. So you have some options in terms of how you um, format the page. You can either make it a scrolling design, so everything's just on one page in different sections, or you can uh, create separate pages. So I'm going to show you how to create those pages once you're in here. Just click on plus, go to new page, and you give it a name. So the first step is to um, ask and then you would put that part of your project in here okay and you do that for each of them each of the uh, each of the steps but if you want to do a scrolling design you just go back to your home and you can just add those sections so every time you click here it adds a section you can change the background color the font um, you can make the section as big as you want and people just scroll down to get to it alright so uh, different ways to do it um, I'm going to give my this is just what the, fi the file is called in my Google Drive. If I go back to Google Drive, you can see it in there. You can see my Google site. So if I ever want to go back and edit, that's how I find it. All right, so there's the, the front end of the site, you know, and you uh, have a lot of options. You know, once you uh, get to the section where you are visualizing, um, you can go in here to insert. You can actually uh, insert a map. If you've created a map of your own, you go to My Maps. And it embeds it. You can expand it to fill more of the screen if you want. So that's how you can put in your different uh, forms of media. All right. So notice that uh, I'm not sure if it's showing up but every time I every time I click on something or add add something it's automatically saved that's just a feature of Google Drive uh, but this website is not visible to other people uh, like me I, I won't be able to view your website until you publish it so you have to go in here click publish it'll give it an, a name automatically you can just leave that name because it doesn't really matter what it is um, if you don't want your website showing up in a Google search you just click on that once you're ready you hit publish just takes a minute and then you go here view publish site opens it up in a new tab okay so there's my website oops it's automatically resizing my map <laughs> okay you just copy that and that's what you submit. There's a text box where you can paste that in D2L. All right. So if you have questions about how to do that, um, you can always just let me know. Uh, a couple more features maybe I'll show you. If you want to change the theme, you have some options for themes here. 
but you don't have a whole lot of uh, design control just because Google tries to keep their website tool uh, pretty simple. All right, if you need help, if you have questions, please let me know, but this ought to at least get you started. All right, good luck, and I can't wait to see these things.